you know, this was a senseless act so people, so people can show, you know, their love for Jaden and just love, you know, the, their love for us, which means so much for us to be able to try and get through this because we're the ones that are left here. Family and friends of a Little Rock man shot and killed last month at a local park gathered this evening for a candlelight vigil. Good evening and thanks for joining us for Fox 16 News. I'm Kevin Keller. I'm Donna Terrell. Our Andrew Epperson was there live. He joins us now. And Andrew, why do family members feel it's important to keep Jaden Shackelford's name out there? Donna, simply they want justice, but they say they haven't gotten it yet since nobody's been charged with Shackelford's murder last month. Jaden Shackelford's family says he was a light in the Little Rock community. Referring to the scripture I just read. And based on the hundreds who showed up to honor him in a candlelight vigil Monday, that seems to be true. Jaden knew a lot of people. Jaden never met a stranger, for one. Shackelford was the second murder victim of the year in Little Rock. Police say the 21 year old was shot here at Meriwether Park January 8th and later died. This was a senseless act. Police Chief Keith Humphrey spoke at the vigil, saying this won't be a cold case. We will catch this coward. Because that's what this individual is. This individual is a coward. And people who attended say they hope Jaden's memory serves a higher purpose, sparking a change. We care. It's not just a, it's not just a random killing. We've we've been having murder and killing, week after week for Jaden's family. I do not give to you as the world gives. They feel optimistic someone will be held accountable. I think they are doing the, you know, to the best of their ability. I really do. Nobody's charged in the murder yet, but police say they've arrested a man on drug charges stemming from what happened on January 8th. We will continue to update you as we learn more about this investigation. Live in Little Rock, Andrew Epperson, Fox 16 News.